Hello everyone, welcome to Big Engineering. In free hypermesh training, today let's do an assignment on refining topology to achieve a quality mesh. In previous session, we have simplified the geometry to achieve quality mesh, but detailing of mesh can sometimes affect the analysis like a fixed point and split surfaces. So in today's assignment, our objective is to suppress all the small edges, split surfaces, and remove exterior fixed point and replace closely placed fixed points and create a final mesh. Okay, so let's go to hypermesh and open a model called clip refine.hm. So our first step is to create a mesh. So let's go to 2D, go to auto mesh, insert, select all, automatic and element size will be 2.5 and pattern will be mixed element to surface component is on and mesh once mesh is created let me okay so now let's check the quality so let's go to tools check element in check element go to standard and when you click into length you can see 0.3% of its failed and you can see over here we have a smaller length which is less than 1 mm and because of it there are larger angles and when I go to assign plot and click to maximum angle you can see there are so many elements which has a maximum elements so we are going to arrange the points such a way that this angle reduces okay so return so first what we'll do is our first step will be to create a primary okay we have created the primary mesh now let's remove the sort edges for that let's go to geometry in geometry let's go to point edit in point edit let's go to replace and then before that let's remove the mesh area and go to wireframe mode okay for better clearance now we can see these two points properly so we can replace this point so in move points let's click into this point and for retain points we we'll click these points and then replace now you can see we have replaced those points and the quality of mesh also is increased Similarly, our next step will be to remove the fixed point. So in previous, we have removed the interior point over here. So we have to go to, sorry, pinhole, we have removed the pinhole, but there is a fixed point for that. So we'll go to point edge, go to suppress and remove those, we can suppress those fixed point. Return. So now once we have suppressed the points, we can go and click into mixed over here. Next step will be to add edge to the surface to control mesh pattern. Okay, so for that, let's go to surface edge. In surface edge, select trim with nodes. And in this, let's go to node normal to edge and then select in node point select this node and then for line select this line now you can see this node is normal to the this line and the edge stays over here and this also increase the pattern of the mesh similarly we'll go for here and this line same we can do for this area as well and this point as well okay data so our next step will be so after replacing the edge points we'll add the add edge to surface to control mesh pattern okay so for that let's go to surface edge then go to trim with surface plane 
okay let me zoom in first and for surface select this four surface surfaces and for n1 click left mouse hold and select this line and click n1 and n2 okay similarly go to f4 and select three node points same way select the circle and select n1 n2 and n3 then go to circle center return once then in base node select the center point okay and then click to trim so now you can see through center points we are getting a line for a mesh similarly return then let's go to edge edit and we'll suppress this area so go to unsuppress unsupp for line select these five lines let me rotate it zoom and select these lines and suppress so once this line is suppressed now we can remesh everything so for that let me on the mesh part then go to tools sorry 2d auto mesh insert select by display uh, element size will keep it as 2.5 everything is set and mesh once mesh is done return okay now you can che uh, check the quality of mesh for that what we'll do is same thing for quality of mesh first go to auto mesh from size and by select batch iq optimize okay and if iq optimize go to edit cr criteria and change this value into 2.5 apply okay and then by display mesh now when we return it and go to quality index you can see comp iq qi is 0.1 so this is how we can increase the quality of mesh with this let's conclude this assignment and meet on next session thank you if you like the video please like share and subscribe if you want to learn any courses regarding mechanical engineering please click the link in the description